Well, I imagine the wound itself would heal, but if you don't want a hole in your hand anymore, you should probably see a doctor about getting fitted with some bone, and then getting fitted with some uh, muscle, and then some skin. And then, you know, the bone will like attach itself to the bone of your hand. Just like, um, what's the word, when you attach somebody else's leg to somebody who lost a leg, transplant, that's it. You get transplant of bone and flesh and muscle. I imagine that's a thing that you can do, and then everything's fine. Don't have to worry about the hole in your hand uh, getting caught on anything. Thank you. I think I would have, you know, put more bandages on my hand after all that, personally. I don't think one roll of gauze is enough. <gasps> Whose blood is this? There's just blood everywhere? And a bit. I'm out for the count. That was real quick. What, should I stay in the water for longer? I can't stay in the water for that long. Damn it. Ran right into that one. Okay, well, where is it? Okay, there it is. I thought you preferred the gentle path. Why would you hurt Nick? Okay, there we go. What? 
What is this? The swamp? Yeah, be real quiet, real quiet. Can't carry any more bandages. What are you talking about? I'll carry as many bandages as I need. How many corpses did you pick over? What? The? Seriously? Coming back earlier. What the fuck? No, oh, some more hangman. D N T. L T. Don't let me go. I wasn't planning on it. Where are you? That's where I was last time. Okay, which phone is ringing? Come on now. This way? Okay, it's not that one. It's not that one. No, no! I didn't realize! Excuse me, I was running away. You're telling me I could run away from a monster and it doesn't matter? Okay, well, where do I go? that room then? It's that phone, I'm guessing. to hide. 
Someplace safe, where you can remember the taste of her kiss when you felt her neck break, you deceased cocksucker. Excuse me? Fear per Aspera? Set us free. The sickness in Saint Sybil. Yeah, it's just static again. There's also somebody whispering in the background. Ruptures. Paradise soon. Laird, there is nothing so wretched among the afflicted as self-pity. And I trust you do not allow yourself sanctification in such womanly sin. Satisfaction. If the disciples I have entrusted you to lead are hungry and in pain and afraid, it's a necessity of their own physical sin and the will of God. I send you to all the food and wine that God wants you to have and no more. I've had visions of this plague worsening. Of all our suffering reaching a point of which none of us will be able to further endure. So rejoice. Take comfort that we will soon reach the center of the suffering and emerge into paradise everlasting. If you can't control your people by your tongue, then do so by the fists of your mount. Papa loves you. God will deliver you. Noth. P.S. I've included a satchel of the salted crickets Nick so loves, please see that he gets them and knows their gift from me. If he really loves these people, you would be sending them medicine.
I don't know what else to do. There they are. They don't seem to be making their way into the house. So I guess it's fine. Wait, how did they shoot it over here? Need to go. Go faster. Nope. 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 Do not do that. into a cactus or something? Still can't carry any more bandages. I guess I didn't heal myself earlier. You want me to kindle the skull? No! I don't want that! have crackers and grape juice around here. Don't! Please, don't! Please, don't! Please! Oh, you crazy motherfuckers! Oh, God! <laughs> shallow burial job. Thanks for the batteries. I'm out of here.
Oh man, I missed something. That makes four things. This here's my brother, broken and killed by the tyrant Laird and his mount Nick. For wine he spilled because of his missing fingers and no real fault of his own. It's terrible, unjust, and I hope a merciful God treats him better. I'm sure he would. Maybe we go this way. Is this what I missed? Please say yes. Don't tell me I missed something in the other dimension. Okay, yes. The trap. Pieces of my skin stuck in the barbs. It was too late to hold her up. Her? And I was just a kid. What? I was just... Okay, Blake is crazy. Still. If you're talking about Jess, she's not here. Scald. Mark Gospel. Oh, how tired Blake I can must still be. Find my way to the mine. Gospel of the Scald Christ. Rejoice greatly, O oh, you scald, you afflicted with boils and sores, and you whose sex cracks and weeps. Your Baptist comes to you astride a donkey in the shape of a man. That Baptist, proportioned as child and all but the tools of a man, and therefore best beloved by the prophet Sullivan Noth. And Noth said unto Laird, What desirest thou in your wretchedness? And Laird said, I desired to behold things which the new Ezekiel saw. And thus said, Ye, thine mind is too tight an arbor for the girth of the Lord's message, and would split at its penetration. Thou shalt knowest only your own salvation. And Laird said, Ye, I believe all the words of my father. And Alf cries, Hosanna in the highest, as thou love me, thou art blessed, and you shall behold the things which thou hast desired. And Laird spoke, I see the heavens open. I see flies smoke in the sky, a cloud of insects bearing down a man, full-grown yet virginal, most beautiful and fair above even the beauty of women. And I looked and knew I behold the Redeemer of the Scald, of whom Ezekiel spoke. And Ezekiel spake unto Laird, saying, Look, the land ministers, the children of the diseased, cocks and festered wounds. And I beheld the multitudes who were sick, and who were afflicted with devils and unclean spirits, who would, would be healed by the power of the Lamb of God. And I, Laird, saw that he was lifted up upon the cross and slain for those who lust delivered them to sin, and whose sin delivered them to lust. And as he hangs, there will be an abundance of milk and wine, such that butter and distilled liquor shall everyone eat that is left in the hand. And they shall proclaim glory of Laird, whom leads them to salvation. And when he gives the ghost and his immaculate flesh hangs dead upon the tree, they shall put him free of the thorns and bury him by the mattock in the earth. And the scalds shall say, We are weary and we are wretched for our hearts and ravaged to thy sins, so that the glorious Laird will deliver, must drive them by the tongue and lash and cock and remind them, it is a small thing to weary men, but will ye weary my God also? And they shall proclaim the glory of Laird, who leads them to salvation. And the scald Messiah shall rise from the grave, and conquering sickness, and conquering death, and those afflicted shall come Emmanuel. And the scald Messiah shall say, This is my flesh, eat of it, and be healed. Whoever eats of my flesh shall have eternal life. And they shall proclaim the glory of Laird, who will lead them to salvation. Yeah. 
You couldn't have picked an original name, guys. Does it have to be Emmanuel? That name's already been taken. Okay, goodbye. Oh. Somebody game ended themselves. Was this an execution? Now what? Which way do I go? Man. She hanged herself before I could stop her. Or she did it. No. Wait, not her? Yeah, that's a guy. Fuck. That bright white light really did not help. Thing is, in the beginning of the game, Blake was already dreaming about Jessica. He's not exactly in the best of minds. Are you kidding me right now? I was aiming for the window. Clearly. The mine. That's gotta be it. How the fuck do I get down there? Thank you. Why couldn't you do that last time? Trophy earned! Bible study! Select 40 documents. Hmm. Okay. Shit. I can't. A rope. I just need a rope. I took your rope. Sorry I had to take the rope from off this pulley because I needed to climb to heaven. Haha. Uh, if that bloated Ezekiel won't give you no more rope. You can cut me down and take it back. Because I expect I'll be done with it. You didn't see nothing. You didn't see nothing. You didn't. You're blind. 